Welcome back everyone, this is Super Star Brother playing The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. In the last chapter we have uh, worked our way up this tower and now we're going to go inside. In there, let's see, I don't, I think there might be a specific pattern to do this to make sure that it doesn't get stuck. I guess we'll find out. I, but I think there is a pattern to... There is a pattern that we have to follow in order to make this work. So that the boxes don't get stuck, or the blocks don't get stuck in each other. Let's see. I'm gonna go see what's over here. Yup! <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> okay. We'll just go ahead and shift all, uh... We'll shift him over here instead. There we go! Alright, let's see what to do. Uh, Goron and Zora, we'll both be using... We'll be using those two. Deka Scrub's gonna be left out. Poor guy. Sounds like Goron here. Nice manly Goron. With a nice manly scar on his belly. Can't get any manlier than that. And a great big scar right in the center of your belly. Taking up almost half of your belly. Okay, we'll just leave one last one. I'm doing... Uh, whoa, 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 what am I doing? I'm trying to take off my mask, that's what I was trying to do. Okay, I'm going to put on some bee bunny hood, because it seems to work better that way. Crossing those blocks, we can get some items here. A fairy, for one. Which I've already grabbed. So, but, I guess a few more couldn't hurt. Except I've already used it, so never mind then. We'll just continue on into the tower. Onto the Inside. And this is, these are here for the same reason that those over there are here. That's what those are for, but we won't be using those buttons. We don't need to use those buttons. But, welcome to Stone Tower Temple. Everybody's favorite temple. And for good reason. Alright. I'm just going to shoot the eye up there. Actually, I'm going to first shoot that dragonfly who got in the way. Because he deserved it. He got in the way. It was it was all him. But we're going to fill that dragonfly. We're going to wait for that bomb chew to blow up while he tries to get us by running around there. <laughs> I'm smarter. It doesn't seem like he's going to blow anytime soon. Oh, well. Bomb Chew, just die already! Oh yeah, sure! Okay. <laughs> Bugger. We found our first Stray Fairy! Alright. Now then, let's see. I don't know if we'll be able to go that way or... Not really a reason to go that way, so we'll just go this way instead. This way is... Let me go... I'm gonna see if I can get this guy to come over here. Ow. And blow up this wall for us. And hey, how do you, how about that? It actually worked. <laughs> hey, I lost a quarter of a health from that bomb shoe that surprised me. But let's see. These two boxes we're going to use. Let's not break these boxes, because we like to use these boxes. And to use this other box, we're going to have to get rid of these two, because they're kind of a nuisance otherwise. Two with one stone! Booyah! Okay. You can see there's a treasure box up there, if I could look. Right up there. We'll be seeing that quite a lot, actually. 
We'll be seeing things on ceilings where they shouldn't be, but are. Which may give you an idea about this temple, but... Ooh, that's a big button. That's a very big button, and the only person that can hold it down is the Goron. He's the only one heavy enough, so we'll just use him. Oh man. <laughs> Somehow, I don't know, I had a brain fart right there. Could not figure it out. But, there we go, figured it out. You're a noisy, noisy car. Or truck, whatever it is. Mufflers. <laughs> Alright. Still having that brain fart. Pretty long one. But there we go. Alright, I want my bunny hood. Because this bunny hood is very useful. Helps us to rush through things. It looks like I might have slowed down time, but because we definitely want all the time we can use, this being the final day. No. Die, dragonfly, thank you. Okay, before we go down here, let's, uh, I'm gonna. Whoops. I'm gonna pull this out. And I'm going to sit right here and explode. There we go. We will want to do that. Because doing that, we'll open the, this uh, hole so that we can shine light on this box. Alright, these armos here, are, they're statues. They're not actually armos because they don't come to life. We can move these statues, though there really is no reason to do that. Okay, I'm just going to pull out my hook shot because there is something around here that we do need to get up to, or it'd be we would like to get up to, because there is a straight ferry up here. There we are. Sand color straight ferry. Okay, to cross this, we're going to need to pull out the gold mask, use that. Okay, these are actually armos right here. Do that, just crouch into their shield, and we'll be just fine and dandy. I get this bomb to boot. That burn it! Punched him! Hmm. I think we do cause a box to appear by these guys. Probably should hit that other armos too while I was at it. Get them both to blow up. Gotcha. Yep, there it is. I believe that's our third straight fairy right there. This also this is a uh, key which we will need. No, but it's a dungeon map. Never mind, forget what I said. Just forget it. I was wrong, you were right. Well, you didn't actually tell me anything, so no, you weren't right. I was just wrong. And you were the sucker to believe me. Anyways, let's get this key. The brain fart goes on! Alright, never mind, I'm not going to say anything about keys or stray fairies or what have you. Unless I'm absolutely certain. Which is to say never. Okay. Alright, what we're going to need to do... Yes, I'm pretty certain of this. No brain fart here. Although that's the nature of brain fart, you never know if, when they're going to hit. 
We actually want this Dexy hand to grab us. Shut us up here. I'm not going to guess what's in here. Okay, fine. Fine. I'll, maybe I'll guess. A stray fairy. Oh, it's a key. <laughs> I thought it might have been a key, but <laughs> yeah. Never mind. I just wanted to. I'm a masochist. I wanted to kill myself. I wanted to prove myself wrong. And just. We can go ahead and do that, which will bring up a treasure box over there, and this one, I am pretty sure, is a stray fairy. That one, I'm pretty sure, is a stray fairy, but probably won't be getting to that for a long while, so we won't be able to tell if I'm wrong or right. So anyways, we'll just come through here. Alright, here's an, here's an interesting area. Okay, what we're going to do... One thing is get rid of these guys. Boom. Nice. How many stones did we throw with that one? Or... How many birds did we get with that one? Before we go on, there are a few things, there's just a few things about this place that we kind of want to make sure that we get done before we actually move on. Hmm. Hmm. Make sure that I have them done. Okay, fine, we'll just we'll move on. Okay, one, one of the interesting mechanics in this temple are the mirrors. Shine light into these mirrors and they will absorb the light for as long as you hold it. And then they'll reflect the light again. Now let's see if we can get this box before it disappears. Yeah. I want the... This is actually leading back into that room that, uh, that room that we entered the temple. I guess you could call it a foyer. Okay, come on. Yeah, there we go. This just leads back to the uh, the foyer, as I've said. Okay, this one I believe is a compass. I am going to say it is a compass. I'm pretty sure it's a compass. Yup, it's a compass. Ha ha ha! Ow! Sure, ruined my big moment, why don't you? It's not as if I ever have these. Moment of triumphs. Anyways, let's just move on. I did try a strategy with this. These pillars can actually be punched. Because these bows, black bows, will continuously spawn. And I tried punching all but the first, or all but the last one, sorry. All but the last one, using that to get up there so that these guys didn't get me while I was in the middle of uh, shining light. This is what we need to do. I did have a little trouble with it. Though, I think it might have been just jumping down. But this is actually a much easier way of doing things so that the balls don't come after us while we're doing this. I'm just gonna shine some light on here, make sure that it's nice and toasty. Nice! opens this up, which brings up a Nehiron, or Nejeron, or... Then again, maybe not. Well, I guess the uh, stone mask actually works quite well. Yep, there he is. <laughs> Oops. That was my fault. Oh uh, yes, these uh, suns. I don't think any... I think only one of them actually gives us anything. 
I'm not sure what these are here for, actually. Just uh, mess around with, I guess. Oh, how about that? Straight fairy, I'm pretty sure. You can quote me on that. Maybe not. Eh, yeah, well, let's go find out what it is. Hey, how about that? It is a straight fairy. But, with that little victory from me, this is Super Stud Brother, to be continued. Hey viewers, you know the drill. If you like the video, click on like. If you want updates, click subscribe. To see the next video, click next chapter. To see the previous video, click previous chapter. To get a box of cookies, drive to the nearest pastry shop and fork over the money. Thank you.